In this video, we're going to look at a, how a peak model can be organized in CASA XPS. And by organized, I mean you can see the relationship between peaks and also color code the relationship between peaks so that you can easily understand the fundamentals that are being displayed by a peak model. So right now, all these component peaks are apparently independent and you can see there are many of them but we can begin by putting up a quantification table that includes the constraints and this is on the components property page and by doing so we will see that rather than having many independent peaks what we've actually got are essentially three different line shapes one for the metal one for the iron 2 plus and one for the iron 3 plus and the peaks that are going to be fitted in essence are going to be the iron the peak that's in column B in the, on the components property page and the peak that's in column G and then all others are fitted using constraints related to those two peaks. So that's the first thing to see is that this is not a massive optimization problem to perform and further we can use the color coding based on the component indices in order to actually visually see the relationship and also produce the envelope that comes from these relationships so now we can see the 3 plus and the 2 plus envelopes clearly as units rather than as separate peaks 